When you're seated at the microscope at the start of surgery and eagerly anticipating the satisfaction of a great result, it comes as a real body blow to have your hopes dashed so early on by a primary tear-out of the rexis. In this movie we're going to look at the causes, the prevention and the management of a primary tear-out. Armed with this additional knowledge you'll stand a much better chance of avoiding it in the first place and of practically dealing with it successfully when it does happen. So first then let's look at the causes. The headline message from this section on zonular anatomy is that the insertions of the anterior zonules are more central than you think. There is actually surprisingly little room for error in judging the diameter of the rexis when you consider the zonular anatomy in relation to the size of the crystalline lens. The average diameter of the crystalline lens is about 10.5 mm. However, the anterior zonules insert over a peripheral ring-shaped zone that extends up to 2.5 mm in from the equator. 